Good morning. Good morning, and welcome back to Crystal Isle. All 139 of you sons of bitches. Yeah, you heard me right. There's 139 of you sons of bitches, and you thought you were the only one. Nope. Today, today we have to finish out our kibble farm down here. And we got, we got the grill here. Should be done. Yeah, it's done. Cooked up a bunch of fucking meat. Um, I'll do something with it here in a little bit. I'm going to make some preserving bins and park them out over here. Throw some oil in them and spark powder. That way we can be making jerky in mass. Um, now the Utes. Utes give us the, the egg to make the teal kibble. Which is the best kibble there is. So really we're, we're in the fucking kibble business. We got the industrial cooker here. And we've been, you know, building up a vegetable stock here for a while. So, what we need now, we have to, we're missing two key components to making the best kibble. And that is sap. I need to check my feed troughs here. Alright, see I put another one underneath there so I can separate the meat and the berries. Alright, we don't want Pego Mastax getting in there and fucking emptying them out. Went up the wrong side. Got a bird in that one. Right here. I changed my sign right there. I have 139 subscribers. You sons of bitches. Alright, I was... You know I was going to do it. I said I was going to do it. I bred, like, the Utes. Like, quite a few. I got some mutes on these. Haven't bothered to check and see what they are yet. I was just breeding and killing and breeding and killing. Look, there was a D-Lo that just got everything all upset. Way the fuck over there. What a fucking mess. I need to put out some plant species X. I harvested some. Just need to set them out. Like, way out over in here. In like a line down through here. That way it can just kill everything gets close. And they can leave my fucking dinosaurs alone. Stupid ass Delos. That's what it is. It's a, every the only thing that's been aggroing me over here is fucking Delos and Ichthyornis. Come on, William. I'm go set you over here. Sit here with the ladies. Get this mess straightened out. Okay, no point in putting y'all through me straightening this mess out. Anyway, I'll straighten the mess out as soon as they get off the mic. Um, so the plan today, I made three sap collectors and tree platform so we can go to the redwoods and poke down the tree platform, put the sap collectors in, and then I'm going to see if I can't find that fucking honey cave that is here. Now we're going to go in there and see if we can live through getting some honey. And I'm going to get enough honey that I can make the S plus fucking beehive. That way I haven't got to go back. I can just keep feeding it wildflowers or rare flowers and just stay in the honey business. Look, Bill, you got an upgrade. Level 345. You're a stud, Bill. You're a stud. Thank you for the nice comment. You know, I don't pump liking and sharing my shit. I just don't. I don't think a man should have to. And I appreciate the fact that you think maybe somebody should. What do we want? We really don't need much anything else on you, Bill. Maybe a little more movement speed. You'll be fast as fuck, boy. Okay, we'll level up the rest of these later. I had some set aside over here for breeders. Wait, I moved them down there. Alright, so all of these are just my pack mules. I don't even have anything to pack anymore on Parasaurs. Bill, I'm probably going to name you something else, bud. What do you want to be? I'll get you something. Want to be a Rex? Want to be one of the Utes? Want to be an Argy? 
Anybody got any wannabe dino requests? Just let me know. I'm more than happy. I'll go hunting just for that some bitch to tame. Look, I said I wasn't going to keep y'all here, and here I am keeping y'all and running my fucking mouth. Man's only as good as the word. See you in a minute. Okay, where was I? Anyway. Yeah, anybody has a, a dino request, just let me know. And, and we'll go out looking and see if we can't find it. I mean, why, what else are we going to do? You know, all I got to do is like run around and get some fucking artifacts and tame up a bunch of Argents, Crystal Wyverns, and Rexes and shit. Yeah, got plenty of time. Plenty of time, and I'm in no hurry. And as evidenced by the fact that I'm flying a fucking Argent all the way over the Redwoods. It's going to be a while. But... Anyway, I got the I got the tree sap collectors on me in the in the tree stand. And we got plenty of weight, so Yeah. I gotta see. I gotta see, you know, if I can remember where that damn cave was to get the honey. And get up in that son of a bitch and Try not to get killed by the fucking dire bears that are fucking swarming all over the place. Maybe just have to give old unnamed Argent here a... Uh, get him involved in a bloodbath. Go in there and just kill a bunch of the fuckers. And not get killed in the process. But that's a problem for, you know, a little while from now. Not right this moment. Right this moment, we're going to try to see if we can put a fucking stand on a redwood tree where we'll be able to remember where the fuck it's at to continue to hit it up for sap. Kind of shitty, but it's what we got to work with. And we're a long ways away from there. Looks like it's probably going to get dark before I get over there. And yes, in case you're wondering, I'm going to fly over toward that red drop just to see if I can make it. I may not, but I might. I still need good shit that you get from drops, like, you know, pimp-ass long-neck rifles, you know, ascended picks and hatchets and shit. If you were paying attention on my inventory, I did get, uh, like, I think it's journeyman hatchet, which, or maybe it's apprentice. Anyway, I think it's apprentice, which helped us out a little bit. Have a good day at school, my girl. Yeah, you did work, man. Anyway, that'll help us out a little bit for for gathering, you know, that kind of shit. But, I mean, honestly, we don't gather that much of that shit by hand anymore. But, you know, the pick would be handy because I think that's what you use to get the honey. go over here get caprasuchus and then die and you know Uteranus can bite me like two or three times and I not die but get a capro on me and I'm gonna be fucking toast yeah I wanted to wanted to get on here and get out here and and get this shit rolling. And get it done because time is short. They really want me to have a fucking Lymantria. And they're the only fucking ones. Yeah, time is short. Today because, you know, my son went to get his boys. So they'll be coming out here in just a little while. The time is short. Time is shorter than a penguin's pecker in a snowdrift. And I'm here to tell you, that's short. So we're going to try to get this done. And I'll record as long as I can. But then I'll have to edit it a little bit and then send it up. You know, the good thing about this hardcore series is I haven't been editing much. You know, I, I ain't too proud not to include my mistakes. What do we got? Ooh, a female 174. Ours is a male, isn't it? I don't have anything to tank it on. 
And I got no fish, got no kibble. I am ill prepared for that. Has that ever stopped me? No, no, it has not. We got all kinds of fucking trap parts. Because I got the trap parts off of Bill, and we had the trap parts from getting our other, our utes yesterday. Don't come over here fucking with me because I'm building a trap now. So leave me a fuck alone. Don't leave the horse alone. Faggots. So what you get? Dicks. Now, where was I? Oh, I was figuring out what walls to put up. Now many. I think we're gonna make a little bitty old trap. I think we ought to be able to get them in a little bitty old trap. They ain't that big. They don't have a big footprint. I know it's just wanting some of somebody. I mean, chase a horse, chasing a fucking Morella tops. It's chasing us. We got to get it chasing us again. Looks like it run over this way, so we need to put the ramps here. All right, let's go get it to chase us again. We can do that. Come here, my dude. My girl. Come here. Wait. You thought we were pretty before. Come on. Look, I'm juking you. I'm trying to outrun you. And that's how we do that. Here, hold this for me. Can you do that for me? Here, hold that. Leave my trap alone. Go sleep. I was going to check and see what level Astego Tech was. Woo! 187. Goddamn, I wasn't coming out taming. I'm coming out doing shit. I got... I got... Ah! Fuck! Alright, I remember I have fish in here. Sorry, Mr. Otter. You're just going to have to go short here for a minute. Oh, might as well go see what's bothering us up in that purple drop. We gotta wait for that thing to starve out some. That way it'll eat a whole bunch really quick and maybe not lose that many levels just taming on regular fish meat. Scope attachment and all kinds of garbage. Hey, there's Sarko over there now. 102 fighting at 114 stego that's iffy country right there over here is going to win that fight there's Sarko coming this way 
162 female. We already got Sarkos. We already got a bunch of Sarkos. I need this Sarko to fuck off. Frog bounce on around over there. It's only level 24 though. I don't think this trap's big enough for a stego. I think I might try it though. Just shoot it, get it mad at me, and then make it run up here and get in a trap. Maybe it'll like get tipped up, ass up in the air, and not know how to back up. Yeah, Sarko took ass whooping. Let's go take advantage. Because we might need their skins. We need to get some more cryopods built too. Something else we need to do. Like I said, I I got no time. I don't have time for this today. But I'm not passing them up. Now we're on the clock. Look, drop down to 88.9%. See, kibble. Kibble's where it's at. I'm thinking I'm, I'm remembering right. I think ours is a is a dude. But having that stego to collect berries, that's gonna be awesome. So we're just going to sit here and let our trap get battered. That works. I can keep up with this Dago when it's running. Sleep. Thank you very much. <clears throat> okay, so yeah, we didn't plan on any of that. We're not gonna be able to pick up any of our trap parts. Kind of shitty. See what we can pick up. to fucking douche you out, dude. Hmm. I should just get this stuff to repair that, huh? 
That way I can pick it up. Let's do that. It's only gonna take, what, some fucking fiber? A little bit of thatch and wood. Not be lazy. Not be encumbered. Need some more berries for our fucking Stego Tech anyway. I like Stego Techs. One eighty seven. Not bad. All right, you just sit over there and you do you. You got plenty of berries now. Still gotta wait 20 seconds to repair everything. That's bullshit. Hey, there's a yellow drop over there. They ain't getting us to the fucking redwoods, though. Jesus. I'm so easily squirreled by drops. Can't even tell we were here. We took the trash with us. Here, we'll throw them supplies on there too in case we need them later. All right, how are you coming along? Thirty-six percent. Let's go yellow drop chasing. We find something else we have to tame over here just because we're not out hunting. We got time to kill. There's some aloes. One fifty six. Well, no, I said I already have Sarcos, but you know, I, I don't have a one eighty. It might have been a one eighty. You never know. How would I know if I didn't scope it? Manus? They really want me to have Arthlopura too, because I got like fucking three Arthlopura saddles. Pretty nice blueprint for the chainsaw. Kind of expensive. Probably never make it, but I have it just in case. There was a yellow drop on here over here was coming down too. So we'll double we'll double whammy the yellows. Unless that was already down and I just misread it. Happens.
bunch of kangaroo down in yonder. Gotta watch out in here for fucking basilisks too. Cause my very first spawn and I died to one not very far from here. Tony Dragon, another GPS, and some garbage. We should be close to tamed up. Oh, damn, my girl, you ain't very fucking hungry. Let's move this weight over. Okay, so I'm going to pause the recording here. No point in wasting y'all screen time. No, see when I'm flying again. All right, as promised, here we are flying again. Going over this way. Not looking to tame nothing. Just looking to go get some shit done. That's not gonna stop my spot and scope from coming out though. Just I'm just saying. Look, fucking titanosaur. They just won't leave me alone. It's hell of a flight over here. But y'all don't mind tagging along, do you? So I may have mentioned it in an earlier video. Um, I'm not certain. I know I was going to. But Daniel had an interesting question earlier in the series. Look at fuck it, go away, dude. About what would happen if you were tribed up in hardcore. Well, I'm gonna find out because this weekend, well probably tomorrow. And I'm um, because my wife doesn't work to, on Fridays. I'm gonna have my wife join in here and I'm gonna tribe her up. And then if I die, we'll see whether or not it is valuable being tribed up. You know, if I can have instant access to all my shit and access to the dinos. Of course, the imprints will be gone. That's a given. But, you know. Uh, riding on an imprinted argent versus a non-imprinted argent um or if a non-imprinted argent versus a pteranodon i'll ride on a non-imprinted argent every time so i'm getting into the you know shit's gonna get dangerous real quick stage you know like i need to you start trying to get some wyverns and those things can kill you fairly efficiently and fairly quickly um got a question out there for all of those who who might know um the net gun that you get on gen one or gen two will it net one of the wyverns here i'm i'm uncertain I don't know that I've ever tried to net a wyvern with one. Because if it will, then that makes gathering those fucking wyvern crystals like 
easy as shit because I just, you know, find like a level 24, net it, shoot it a couple times, knock it out, and go harvest this crap. Because unless they change the rules, even stealing an egg, you got to have the, the crystals to raise it up. Because that's what they eat. You know, so if anybody knows any otherwise or can positively reinforce that, just let me know in the notes. So I kind of earn the comments. That way I, I know what to expect other than just dying. Speaking of Rexes, 156, that's not bad. Look, I said I wasn't taming anything else. That was before there was a 156 Rex right there. I haven't got kibble. That's not, I'm not doing it. 156, I mean, it's kind of, kind of awesome, but not like superb. And I'm this close to kibble. You know, if I'd have had kibble, I wouldn't have lost fucking so many levels on, you know, the other two teams I just got. That's your price you pay, though. For taming early. Alright, now we gotta find a fucking redwood. Because I don't, I don't remember if there's any trees you can whack on to get fucking sap on this map. Hey, look, we've been wetting one of those. Wetting one of those for a long time. Oh, and it's even a good one. Fuck yeah, Mrs. No Name fucking Argent. You're fixing to whip some ass. I got the faith. We're killing this fucking 174. Fuck you, dude. Chick, I think you were a female. Tried to get your bugs to help you out, and it didn't help you out a bit. You missed me. You missed me because you suck. Because you're a fucking carno. You hit pretty hard, though. I ain't gonna lie about that. You may have to make me reconsider my life choices. Miss an unnamed Argent. Kick the shit out of this fucker. That's the way you do it. Right there. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Fucking four more levels. We're poking them all into fucking melee, too. What do we get? We get anything good? Get anything yummy? Some fucking hide pants. That's bullshit. Um, a little increased damage on above 111, like advanced primitive crap. We just got screwed. I feel violated. Alright, so let's find some big fucking tree. It preferably doesn't have a thylacolio stuck to it. I don't remember if thylo thylos fucking spawn in this biome on this map or not. Alright, I don't think I spent much time ever in the redwoods here. 
Got as low as we can go. Here, let's go up there. We ain't got to go low. We'll go high. Access them all because I was seen in a video one time that you need to do that or else some of them might not activate. Hey, let's do that. We got some fancy ass GPS now. We're at 32 by 34. 32 and a half by 34, basically. Thirty-three point eight. Make it yellow so we can see it over here too. Now we're pinned up. So we'll not forget where it's at. All right, so down in here somewhere. Along this cliff edge. Is the entrance to that honey cave? So let's see if we can find it. Back in here. Remember it being back in a cubby. Quite a bit of metal rock in here, though. All right, so far, I'm not seeing Dick. on the wrong level. Maybe it's that next level down. I don't think it's the next level down. I think there's an aerial entrance too where you can come down from the top. You may just have to look at the top of the fucking place. See if we can find it that way. Cause I'm not I'm not having any luck here and I'm not feeling good about this. I feel like I've passed it.
I can't fly around the redwoods without feeling like fucking thylacolio bait. seeing hide nor hair of any like upper entrance either what's that right over there oh that's just that little cubby I flew into Not seeing it, folks. Just not seeing it. Ah, found it. Hey, there's a squatch. It's only level 72. I haven't got any kibble anyway. Stop looking, fucker. All right, so there's some giant queen bees there. Oh, this is making me nervous. Here's the entrance. Now, if I remember right, you just harvest this with a fucking pick. We're about to find out. Bear better fuck off. Or I better fuck off away from that bear. Anyway, there's some fucking off going on. That bee better fuck off too. I don't want nothing to do with none of that. I don't remember if they get mad when you harvest this shit or not. Guess I'm about to find out. Yep, I guess they do. Y'all come on in. My R's gonna fuck you up. Anybody else? Yep, you're coming. Come on.
They're trying to fuck me up. You see that? I, I think we need to try the ha axe. See if that works any better. Oh, you fucker. How are we looking? Oh, I need to eat. It doesn't work any fucking better. How much honey we got? We ain't got a lot. I don't need all this fucking polymer. You come here for polymer. like a butt ton of this stuff. We don't need all this weight from that shit either. We don't need to wear flowers. We got a bunch of our flowers at home. the rocks nope none all right we'll just keep whacking these I ain't proud I ain't dying so We need like 50 of them, I think. Might save the next couple of batches of polymer too. Just because. Might want to build some shit that takes polymer. Okay. 
There, let's put some weight on the bird with polymer. We got the bear coming over here, see what's up. I tell him to politely buck off. And leave us to our harvesting. Looks like you get more polymer with the fucking axe than the hatchet. Or the hatchet than the... The pick. And more honey with the pick. By far. that give us we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten sixty sixty six seventy one yeah we might get a couple more Just harvest these two here and then we'll be on our merry and we will go back home after we check our sap collector it may have collected some sap by now oh this one's a mother load look at that 15 was nice yeah we got a lot out of that one all right now I do know that down over in here is an artifact down this tunnel right here Down in that water. Got to go swimming around in there. See if you can't get lost. Get to some artifact. And I do believe that's where the element dust is on this map. Or element ore. Whatever you fucking mine and you put in the put in the charge nodes. All right, so we got our honey, y'all. Enough to make the, the S plus collector. The S plus beehive. I wonder if it's dark or if it's just one of them red sky moments. It's like one of them red sky moments. All right, so let's see if we can find our fucking priest hand. See if we might have a dollop or two of fucking sap. Been over here a while, hunting around. Get out here so I can see the terrain because that's what I use for markers. Alright, so it wasn't there. It's over this way. Yep, there it is. Let's 
seen it. A little bit. Enough to get us started. that y'all that's all I really needed to do today was go out there and get that shit set up back at home sheep spawn in this fucking map anyway I don't fucking remember and I haven't seen a single fucking one Carno. place is pretty boring. I don't need the excitement like I had fucking yesterday, though. I mean, I, I, I thought that Yudi was going to just fucking eat my ass. I don't know how I managed to take, like, fucking three hits. He must have just barely nipped me. Because he's got decent melee. But, I mean, I, I thought it was fucking done. It was just crazy. Really made me think I should already had my wife tribe me up. All the right numbers, all the wrong order. There's another doe dick. Not a good one, though. Yeah. Yesterday, though, was a pretty good day on the arc. Kind of like this one's chafing out to be. You know, wasn't even looking for anything to tame, and I got two in my pocket. And now I'm just looking because that's kind of what I do. Obsessive compulsive dinosaur taming. <laughs> They're going to name a new disorder after me. That's why we're alcoholics. It has nothing to do with the beer that's sitting right there. Becky, I think we're going to have to, like, get you in the water. I mean, you're already in the water, but we're going to have to get you out in the deep, scary water. See if you can, like, help me live through it. Because, I don't know, kind of want to go in the water. We don't need any of that crap. See if we can get some some juice from the Nidera. Make some shock and drink darts. 
So I might actually use a long neck rifle. Right now, though, this fucking crossbow's been doing me proud. So, no reason to kick it to the curb, is there? It is taking care of business. Doing its job. I'm gonna kill the shit out of these guys. Just cause they were fucking with hackies. And that's just rude. What do y'all reckon we should boss fight with here? Just a bunch of pimp ass fucking crystal wyverns? Cause this is one boss fight other than the the King Titan on Extinction that you can take flying creatures in. When my wife and I done it, we done it with some crystal wyverns and a bunch of like Argent said I'd mutated the shit out of. And it got it done, but you know, I'm subject to I'm I'm open to other suggestions. There was a baryonyx over there, I seen it. Mail one sixty eight. Yeah, Barry Onyx can't hide from me. I can smell him like a fart in a car. I haven't really seen any frogs worth taming on this thing yet. Of course, I don't ever do nothing with the frogs except, you know, tame them. Rode them around in the water a couple of times. But anyway, I mean, do we want to do like the, should I do the whole like fucking bunch of Rexes and, uh, and, and Udys? Just a standard boss fight fucking dino mix? Instead of only fought it once. Don't really know what the best strategy is. And of course, you know, I, I can't, I can't lose it. You know, come out of it dead, then I don't come out of it. You know, it's just fucking start all over again. Thank you for fucking playing. So I'm open to ideas. Anything anybody's got out there. Like I told Dan in the note that I that I or the comment that I replied to on yesterday's video. Um, I think I'm gonna take and just breed the shit out of my fucking RGs. Might go hunting around here when I'm like one of the times, multiple times when I'm off camera doing shit. Here's another 168 female spino. We got a 164 for you though, Allison, so you don't need a sister. But I'm going to take the, the Argents over. I'm just going to breed up a bunch of Argents. I just keep rambling. Because I'm scatterbrained. Um, 
I'm gonna go out hunting and try to find a, a 180 male. I still haven't leveled up the 180 female, so I still got, you know, the, the base stats. And find a 180 male. And tame it up, and then just start breeding a bunch of max level fucking Argents. Until I get a nice base breed. A perfect core stat breed. And then just start breeding it for mutations. And take it up and fight the fucking big mean ass crystal wyverns. The elder crystal wyverns. With Argents. Seeing if I can't rain down some ruination on them with that. Because, you know, I get, you know, 10 or 15 Argents following me. I don't know that there's really much that's going to fuck with me. Or be able to fuck with me. I'm just about out of stamina, but I'm not far from home. Oh, we gotta stop anyway. Now them steely fuckers can annoy me. Take my shit. I'm not seeing anything fun. Just not. What about monkeys? Anybody know where monkeys spawn on this map? I don't know if I've ever seen a monkey on this map. Do monkeys even spawn here? Rendron in there. Look, I got this windmill in a drop, and so I just figured I'd put it out here just for the aesthetics. But I think it looks pretty cool. You know, all the way out there at the end of the dock. Yeah. I like it. All right, let's go up here and make us an S plus beehive. Farming. Yep, right there. We'll be able to make a couple of pieces of cable, y'all. Wait, I'm the saddles in here. Away from me, faggot. All right, we got level up. A couple of them. Well, what are we going to put it in? Let's do fortitude. All right, now we need to learn Stego Saddle. So we can make one of those.
And we need to make another berry saddle. Nice, nice. See if a beehive's done. Just about. Right, good old Stego Tech. We gotta change the plate formation. There we go. We are in the fucking berry business. In every good way possible. I mean, look at that shit. God, you gotta fucking love them. You just gotta fucking love them. Anything better for grabbing berries? I've never seen it. Hey, put my stabby stick in there. Give me that back. Yeah, we gotta go pet the puppies before we start that. Big Doug and Little Doug. It would be Douglas and Doug Moore. Ha ha ha. Wait, I need to get the beehive. Oh, been a long day, y'all. Sorry. Let's put it over here, right in between the cooker and the beer. What do you think? We need some rare flowers. Which we have a plenty. Hey, we got some beer done. We need to throw some more berries in there. Good thing you got a stego. I knew we had a dude. It was fucking David. Alright, y'all stop looking at me so I can leave. Stats aren't looking too bad there, Becky. Crafting turned off. See what we can make. Lazarus chowder. What do we need for that? Mm 
Make a couple of these. I know we have a couple of fucking yew eggs. Come on, I know uteranus egg does the fucking does that kibble. Ankleo. Moose chops. Uteranus. Yeah. Look, there's one piece of fucking extraordinary kibble. Argents do blue. What do moose chops do? Not yellow. All right, so moose chop eggs do the purple. Wow, that takes 60 sap per. What's your sap, my bird? Oh, you ain't my bird. Well, you are my bird, but you're not the one I need. Okay, he must have used all the sap already. Making that one piece of fucking teal. Right, I was gonna do it over here. Not what I wanted at all. I think that's gonna be the blue. No? Oh, they do the yellow or the purple as well. So it looks like I'm gonna have to fuck around and run over and get some more sap before I can make any of that kibble. We don't have dinosaur eggs for that. We can make a couple of more of these, though. Three pieces. Of course, we can use fertilized uteranus eggs if we wanted to. But we really don't want to. Okay, y'all, so... That was today. I mean, wasn't a whole bunch to it, but I mean, we got two completely unexpected tames. I'll be able to breed the berries, you know, and, and get an imprinted berry. I like having imprinted dinos of every dino I got. At least one. But yeah, I have a selection of dinos now, people. So, you know, tell me what you want to be. And, and... I'll name something after you. That way it's more like you guys are coming with me when I'm going. You know, take two or three yardens with me, you know. Like to have names on them. Like to name you for a dinosaur you wanted to be. 
And I got no problem going out hunting from one to fucking tame to name name you. But thank you all for watching. Thanks for subscribing. I appreciate it. Like I told old Bill, it's nice to nice to know that what I'm doing here is appreciated. And I'm not just wasting my time. You know, it started for two people. Those two people still watch. And I'd still do it if it was just those two people. But 137 of you, the rest of you. You know, you, you deserve a quality product. And something that you like to see. Anything I can do to make it better for y'all. Don't hesitate to let me know. But I hope you guys enjoyed your day. I'm going to fuck around on here for a while. It's going to get loud in just a short. So I might as well end it here while it's quiet. And I'll see what I can do about getting this thing edited and uploaded for y'all today. I hope you enjoy. Talk to you later.